Welcome back. Now that you have your D2L gradebook all set up, let's look at how to sync your My Math Lab gradebook to your D2L gradebook. From your course homepage, scroll down until you see that Pearson My Lab and Mastering widget on the right. Click that to open up the widget. Now click on this second tab that says Grade Sync. First, you'll notice that you can turn your automatic grade sync on or off. And then just below that, you'll see a list of all of the assignments that are in your My Math Lab course. If you know that you want to sync all of those to your D2L gradebook, you'll just select All here at the top. Now notice that all of my assignments have this Auto Sync enabled next to them. If that doesn't appear for you, you'll need to come back to the top and click this button that says On to turn Automatic Grade Sync on. Once you've selected all of the assignments that you want synced to your D2L gradebook, you're going to come over to the right and click this blue Sync Grades Now button. You'll notice that next to each assignment, it's slowly syncing. You'll want to scroll through and make sure all of your assignments that you asked to auto-sync actually synced. And once that's done, you can go back to the tab for your D2L course and go back to the gradebook section by clicking Grades here at the top. You'll notice that your calculated grade sum has jumped to higher than 100%. That's because all of the assignments from my math lab came in as individual categories. So if you scroll through your list of graded assignments, you'll see that each of the assignments I brought in from my MML are in their own category. So I need to go into Manage Grades and reassign each individual grade item to the category that it belongs to. Remember, we did this in that previous video when we were setting up our gradebook. So click on Manage Grades on the top left. Then we want to go and select all of the assignments that we need to manage or relocate to categories. Since I'm syncing a large number of grades from my math lab into D2L, I find it easiest to click this top left box, which selects every single assignment, and then I'll go through and man manually deselect those assignments that I don't need to manage. Okay, a little computer magic happened and I selected all of the assignments that I need to manage and move into the correct categories. I just do a quick visual check to make sure that I actually have all of those assignments selected. And then I'm going to click on Bulk Edit. Now you'll remember seeing this screen from when we were setting up our D2L gradebook. You're going to pay attention to that very first column. That's the name of the assignment. And then the very last column, the category. And remember, you're going to click the category that you need to assign that assignment to. So this very first assignment for me is an exam review. And for my course, that's a homework. So I'll put that into homework. And my second is an actual exam. So that'll go into the exam category. Now that I've selected a category for each of those assignments, I'm going to click the Save button on the bottom left. This is going to re allocate all of those items into the correct categories. So if I go back to my gradebook by clicking on Enter Grades, now I no longer have that warning at the top that my percentage is over 100%. That's because I've put all of the grade items into their categories. So I really love my math lab syncing between its gradebook and the D2L gradebook because every time a student completes an assignment or works on an assignment, it constantly updates their grade. Now, sometimes there can be issues with how frequently my math lab syncs to D2L, and there might be a little discrepancy between the two gradebooks. In my math lab, if you go back to that grade sync area, you'll see here it says recent syncs. If you click on this, it'll let you select automatic sync. So that's when it's synced on its own based on a My Math Lab schedule of syncing or manual syncs. 
Manual syncs are when you've actually told the system to sync grades now by pushing that blue button. So you might want to check that if you're noticing that there's an issue between the two gradebooks. Otherwise, that's it for setting up your My Math Lab gradebook to sync to your D2L gradebook. Thanks for watching.